Emerging from their fourth meeting, the South Style Roundtable says the time has come to ensure all the facts are in the public domain. There have been a number of statements uh, coming into the public domain, in particular one by the Attorney General which sought to mislead and misinform the public on the issue and on the Constitution and on the um, powers of the President. And because there's this misinformation, it is very necessary that as a roundtable we engage in a program of information and education so that all citizens would be aware of the provisions of the Constitution, of the um, nature of our letter to His Excellency and the relationship of that to the Constitution. While he did not divulge what manifestation it would take, the details of this public education campaign, Mr. Abdullah says, will emerge fairly shortly. Having received no feedback from President Richards, who they petitioned last week to invoke his powers under Section 81 as yet, they urged patience. We have to allow His Excellency the time to consider carefully and be advised, as, as we had said, Dr. Roger had said in the press conference we had last week, His Excellency has to take time to look at our letter and to be advised legally and so on. And His Excellency, we are sure, will make a decision and we'll be informed. While the President's intervention is key to their cause, the group says they are not focusing their energies on that aspect of their approach. Giovanni Ravello, TV6 News.